Hey everyone, it's uh, Dr. Wayne Crawford from the management department at the University of Texas at Arlington. And I just wanted to spend a few minutes with you today, chatting with you about all these transitions that are going on and uh, and uh, what kind of what you might be contemplating you, you might do next uh, with your life, uh, given all of this uncertainty. Uh, for those of you who don't know me, uh, I am uh, a faculty member at UTA in the management department, and I teach at the undergraduate and graduate levels. Uh, coming to you from my home office, so I feel your pain. I've been uh, been struggling to teach from afar and and research from afar, and not having the structure, the daily structure of life that we that we're so accustomed to. And also have a four year old who's running around, and we're trying to limit her screen time while also maintaining our sanity. So uh, I feel your pain. Um, if you don't know me, I'm an analytics guy. I teach HR analytics and organizational consulting in the in the Masters of HR program. I also teach analytics to our doctoral students at UTA. And then for undergrads, I teach uh, 3320, which is our human resource management course. So uh, you may have seen me around uh, the, the building, the College of Business building. Uh, you may have had me in one of those classes, and if not, hopefully I'll be able to see you in one of those. Um, you know, for me, this this struggles, uh, this transition has been a struggle, and uh, for a number of different reasons, uh, teaching analytics is not is not easy uh, in and of itself, and a, a lot of people struggle with it, particularly those without uh, a lot of experience with math and without a, much of a math background. And then if you add on that virtual technologies of having a remote in. Uh, that can be quite a struggle too. So uh, it's been a, it's been a difficult transition, but we're finally getting through it. And uh, as the semester wraps up, hopefully, uh, hopefully it'll all come to a conclusion and we can grow from this experience. Uh, I know uh, for you students out there, I know that you guys are having a tough time and trying to figure out what to do next. Maybe you have some uncertainty in your life coming up. I know I've heard of folks who uh, have been laid off, students who have been laid off from their work, students who have... Uh, dealt with internship cancellations and not really sure what to do next. And uh, I'd encourage you to consider uh, our graduate programs. Uh, there's a lot of good reasons to go to UTA. We have world-class faculty. We have people doing cutting edge research, publishing in uh, some of the most elite journals. Uh, our, and, and that really applies across the college. So whether you're taking management classes in our MSHRM program or electives in other areas, they're all taught by uh, really good faculty really experienced faculty. Uh, in the management department, we also have the PhD program. So uh, there's even been cases where people have taken, really taken to analytics and academic uh, research uh, in their master's programs, do either through a thesis or something like that. And we have a great PhD program that you can also funnel into from our master's program. Uh, so that opportunity is there. Uh, we have a lot of great people, a lot of great graduates and um, great practitioners that teach in our program, as well as great uh, research-oriented academics. So um, I think there's a lot of great reasons that you might consider, you might consider coming, uh, coming to the, uh, talk to Tom or myself about uh, our MSHRM program. And, uh, and I just wanted to say, I hope you guys are all transitioning well. Uh, I look forward to hopefully seeing you around in the future. And uh, if I can ever do anything for you, uh, my office is in 212 in the College of Business, and I'm happy to hang out and chat about anything from sports to HR. So uh, I'm always available, and uh, hopefully we'll hear from you guys soon. And I hope that you are all making a, a smooth transition, or, or at least as smooth as possible. So you guys have a great week.